punching me with her nose. Very demanding poodle. That's weird. Zelda, can I help you, friend? You can't see it, but Zelda's Zelda. right here. So I just left the school, and tonight I'm... Wait, where are you? <laughs> Third stop of our bar crawl, that's where. I thought work was done for the night. Licking the wounds of rejection, huh? The 99 gang with you? Just Sugiura. Tsukumo said he had to get back to the office to take care of some kind of system trouble. A computer crash or something? I don't know. Something about a buzzy searcher going haywire. I pretty much tuned it out, man. Anyway, you gotta come take his place? Nah, I gotta stay sober. I'm meeting Sawa Sensei in a bit. You what? God damn it, man. You are killing me today. Would you simmer down? This is simmer work, down now. not whatever it is you're doing. Simmer oh, down now. Then I ought to come be your backup. Where are we <coughs> headed? Come on, you think I need a drunk co-pilot? Knock one back for me, though. Hey, I better not find out you two got it on. Don't do this to me, Talk. <laughs> I don't know if I missed something like oh you know I just realized my dumbass I I think I skipped the credits in the beginning of the chapter the end of the whatever chapter I think I need to load it and load the last one and ugh I just realized that I'm like, I skipped stuff that I'm like, oh crap. <sighs> yes, this is what I, I, I skipped through these. Two months ago, a young man named Hiro Mikashiba went missing during his stint as a student teacher. Mikashiba quickly becomes the center of attention when his rotting corpse is discovered. And Yagami scours the school for any clues left behind. Rumor has it, Mikashiba drove a classmate to suicide in his student days. A rumor that the school faculty is seemingly unable to deny. I was like, I missed something, and I did. This article might be about Mikoshiba, but it's not reporting the identity of the corpse. Does that mean the police are still withholding information? Their interview with Sawa-sensei seems to be taking an awful long time. Yagami-san, why are you still here? Because I care. Now, if you're open to the idea, you think we could walk and talk? Why? So you can grill me with more questions? You realize the police just finished doing that, yes? I figured they'd come knocking sooner or later. Then you knew Mikoshipa-kun was murdered, didn't you? And that's why you've been snooping around our school. You're not wrong, but can we please take this elsewhere? If you knew Mikoshiba was murdered, why didn't you tell me up front? Because that information's not public. Didn't the police ask you to keep quiet about it? Well, yes, but 
Even so... What sort of questions were they asking you anyway? I thought I was supposed to keep quiet. Cute. Now I'm going to ask you one last time. Please, stay off our campus. You don't belong here. Hey, I'm an I advisor. Mean, what if you end up injuring a student? It would be a nightmare for all of us. Nobody's getting injured. All that's water under the bridge now. Is that so? Yeah, and I should probably mention, I'm the new advisor of the Mystery Research Club. I have the chairman's approval and everything. So, it looks like I have a place here after all. What? Since when? I think we're getting sidetracked here. Did the police ever mention a suspect? No. All they told me was what happened to Mika Shibakun. That he's no longer a missing person. That he's dead. And was dumped in a derelict building. My condolences. That was all we I just need to move my camera a little bit. Uh... Cause I'm kind of covering up my dude's face. We found out. The police were the ones asking the questions, not us. They hardly gave us room to breathe. Yeah, sounds like an interrogation, all right. Are the police keeping Ahara's connection under the under wraps while they investigate the mur this murder? Is there anything else? Actually, there is. I'd like to know your thoughts on Miko Shibakun's killer. What? For example, take Akihiro Ehara, a man who took this school to court over his son's suicide. Miko Shiba came up even then, as a culprit bearing some responsibility for that. Ehara-san? But he got arrested for that groping incident at the train station. So the police really are keeping their lips sealed. Must you always be so cryptic? It's possible Ehara-san had a hand in Mikoshiba's murder. What? Despite being incarcerated for two months, he knew exactly where the corpse would be. He revealed it upon being sentenced. This was before the Kanagawa police had even ID'd the body. Then... was it really Ehara-san? A court would say being in jail is about as solid an alibi as you can get, but he could be connected somehow. How do you know all this, Yagami-san? I'd tell you, but I showed you one of my cards, so now it's your turn. Uh, huh? I've heard you weren't as big a fan of Mikoshiba as you led me to believe. That true? <sighs> this again. You knew he was a bully all along, but yesterday you told me he wasn't the type. I just want to get the story straight here. <sighs> Did you have a sudden change of heart, or were you lying to me for some reason? It's not that simple. Oh, one more thing I learned today. It was Miko Shiba who turned the basketball club against Kodasan. Pretty sadistic for a would-be teacher, don't you think? That's enough. Then it's not a stretch to say he probably was a major factor in the death of Ahara's son four years ago? And I think it's also safe to assume you know more mm. than you're letting on, right? This is murder we're talking about here. Lies aren't doing anyone any favors. <sighs> His name was Toshiro. Sorry? Everyone keeps saying Ehara's son, like he's just another statistic. He had a name for heaven's sake. Toshiro. Right. I'm sorry. Now if you'll excuse me, I have papers to grade. Mm. I it's have papers to Please. Nine o'clock tonight. I'll be at Plage on Izazaki Road. Plage? We finally have a real talk? Something like that. Okay, now we are here. Yeah. All the bullshit in this game that, like, I don't know if it's the same thing, but the first one, it was all for the drone racing. Jesus. I already did this phone call earlier, but... Kaito-san, so I just left the school and tonight I'm... Wait, where are you? <laughs> Third stop of our bar crawl, that's where. I thought work was done for the night. Licking the wounds of rejection, huh? Is the 99 gang with you? Just Sugiyura. 
Tsukumo said he had to get back to the office to take care of some kind of system trouble. A computer crash or something? I don't know. Something about a buzzy searcher going haywire. I pretty much tuned it out, man. Anyway, you gotta come take his place? Nah, I gotta stay sober. I'm meeting Sawa-sensei in a bit. You what? God damn it, man. You are killing me today. Would you simmer down? Marty! Work, What's up, buddy? Whatever it is you're doing. I'll oh, do that in a second. Then I ought to come be your backup. Where are we headed? Come on. You think I need a drunk co-pilot? Knock one back for me, though. Hey, I better not find out you two got it on. Don't do this to me, Talk. Okie dokie. Son of a bitch. What's up, Marty? Roddy Rod! It is what it is. All right, you son of a bitch. I'm in. Did I just get hit by a car? Fucking aim. No, you wouldn't, Marty. No, you wouldn't. My tattoo is in the itchy phase, and it's just like, and it's scabbing still. But like, damn. Ugh. Fuck. Okay. Let's go beat up random people. Oh, no. How's your day going, Marty? It's good to see you, man. You know, all the shit being on the sidewalks, I mean, you're not allowed to... Just picking up random cigarette butts? Oh, not gross, oh. my dude. Beating up random people. Do 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 do. Do I have, I have five iron plates? I really do need to go to the pawn shop then. Where's the pawn shop? It's like down. Yeah. Oh, Jay, hey, what's up, friend? That's not enough sleep. Also, Madi, I have told my sister I'm worried about her more than once because of her, ex like, she takes very, like, extreme approaches to most things in life. And it's just like, uh. OJA, it's good to see you, friend. How you doing today? So I'm just beating up random high school students. Like, not at school. Really, guys? I haven't I haven't seen what you're talking about, but it doesn't surprise me. I mean, it's I I've told her before. I told her when I went out for her surgery that like I was concerned that she was going to because I, I was like, you're gonna wake up someday and and think that being trans didn't fix all your problems and then or, or having your surgery isn't going to fix all your problems, you know, and like yeah and yeah I, I 
I want her to be happy. I'm just like, she's a very extreme person. Thanks for stopping by, OJA. She, my, my sister has dealt with depression most of her adult life and including being checked into like hospitals for it. So she's, it's just always just worrying about her hitting a stretch where it's, where she takes an extreme, you know? Uh, I, I tr that's what I try to do. I try. Not always easy, but I try. Soul, what's up, buddy? I got the stupid thing. <laughs> Have fun, OJ. Have a good night. Get some good sleeps. It's, uh, yeah, it's very, these games are very, very Japanese, body. Very, very Japanese. So how are you doing tonight? Uh, today, time zone, my friend. I hope you're doing well. Seems like you're picking up the Japanese pretty well then, my friend, because Japanese, like I'm, my brain doesn't work well with languages. Kick to the face. Sounds like you got the living the dream there, Soul. Yagamishi, how was school? Kaito-san wasn't happy about you going solo, you know. Eh, he'll live. He can cry about it to My Sugira. arm is so, so goddamn scabby. Anyway, Almost I couldn't help but though. notice Skenda Law bending your ear earlier. Anything important? It would be good right. for that, Madi. I haven't filled you in yet, have I? So a policeman arrested for sexual battery might have actually been involved in a murder? Fascinating, if not perplexing. Yeah, and its roots could very well be Serio High School, where a student was driven to suicide four years ago. In fact, the motive for this murder may even be revenge. Tsukumo, could you find any mention of that suicide online for me? <laughs> Already done, I'm afraid. Once the chairman asked us to take his case, how I cold is it where you are? On the school so I don't I know where find. you live. I, I mean, I, you don't have to if tell me. If memory serves, he was a third year student who hung himself at home. The name of the deceased, Toshiro Ehara. Yeah, that's him. So while I did find some murmurings about it online, nothing really substantial ever surfaced. He didn't leave a suicide note or a will, and investigators never found anything salient. So I was right before. No mistaking it, that's the same person as the photo on Sawa Sensei's desk. His father, however, suspected there may have been a bully and promptly took Serio to court. But without enough evidence to back it up, the system more or less spit him out. 
Even so, the lawsuit dragged on until this year. But that level of news hardly makes a ripple online. Yeah, I doubt it would. And that's all the intel I've dug up regarding the case. Huh? <laughs> What's that sound? I'm testing a system I've been tinkering with. Thought I'd fixed this bug already. A system for what? Well, it predicts the occurrence of crimes. It predicts crime? No way. <laughs> Perhaps that was a bit of hyperbole. But it does come pretty close. Essentially, this system is designed to monitor and detect danger zones within a specific area. The city itself, to be exact. That still sounds pretty amazing. If you say so. I basically cobbled it together out of pre-existing tech. Yagamishi, do you remember when I used my chatter search program for you not too long ago? Oh yeah, that was a real trip. We pretty much hacked chatter to see an entire social network at a glance. Yep. And this system I've developed is a souped-up version of that. Though there are substantial differences, the principle is still... Uh, how about you just try it out? We'll start with this little window. It displays all relevant chatter the posts after filtering come. the fluff. Sound the and these posts are all pinpointed on the ninja. Winter storms blow. How goes the show? What is that glow? Poop rod your rocket. Poop. Poop was a good uh, uh, end on there. Thank you for 32 months, my friend. That is, Jesus Christ, you were closing in on three years. That is a long time, and I appreciate you, friend. God damn it, Marty. You son of a bitch. Right. It maps out where... It... You son of a bitch. I mean, you're not the only problem, Marty. Pat be out there doing this shit. I mean, I could, I could, but I'm not going to do that, Marty, because that sucks, Lyle. I mean, always welcome, Marty. It's called I'm Single Soul, and I'm trying to make it so I'm sexier for, for the women out there. <laughs> In Ijincho, each specific post was made. So my AI constantly... It's a lot of things, actually. I'm trying to get healthier. Real time. Time. Then it extracts only the trouble-related chatter for display on the map. So it actively seeks out trouble? It's wild that you can program around such a vague concept. Well, in its current iteration, the AI isn't exactly genius material yet, so it still pings some false positives. There's something else, Tsukumo. What are you going to use it for? I'd like to use it for promotional purposes. Like advertising? Yeah, since we're still Ugh, relatively sucks, new in Lyle. town, we don't have the kind of rep that brings in regular You, you are, something like that, Marty. Oh, uh, okay. And that is where my buzz researcher comes into play. Buzz researcher? Consider the glut of trends and terms strewn across social media. These buzzwords are sometimes clues to trouble beneath the surface. So, when the system picks up one of these words and we rush over to save the day, the hope is our reputation will flourish as a result. Damn, that's some pretty intense marketing you've got going. Well, we probably won't be paid for impromptu. Do you work cases, tomorrow, so This is sort of an upfront. Hey, that would not be fun. But directly intervening before a situation gets out of hand will build us the brand we want. Uh, at least in theory. I'm not sure how it'll all pan out yet. Well, I think you've got something there, Tsukumo. Mind if I give it a shot? I thought you'd never ask. Though the system's got a long way to go by my standards. But with you as a tester, I know I'll get strong enough feedback to have this baby running in top form. <laughs> it's 
So you wanted me as your guinea pig all the Yeah, it makes sense, Vile. That's too dangerous. <laughs> you sure cracked that case quick. Anywho, let me get this out. I got an email yesterday morning. Yeah, they the still honors. have no day on my car. Right and I'm fucking annoyed. I just want my fucking car. And that should uh, do it. Here you are. Okay, let's see here. Um, this is just a big mess. How am I supposed to know where to go? Hmm. This is indeed too much noise. In fact, this is entropy in motion. This won't do it all. To solve this, we narrow down the keywords. In other words, simplify our search? Yeah. By manually filtering keywords, we can decrease false positives, thereby locating the right spot more accurately. How do we do that? Does the AI do it for us? No, not entirely. What the AI does is pick up on any keywords it deems important. Emphasis here on the word any. Meaning it'll turn out duds every now and again. Yeah, that's still pretty busy. And Damn therein body. lies the predicament. To narrow these results down any further, we must depend on instincts, experience, and even inspiration. So you're saying human intuition? <laughs> Precisely. Even in this day and age, human intuition will trump AI every time. That is, until we all become cyborgs. But that's getting ahead of myself. As it stands, Yagamishi, you've got the best intuition out of all of us. Well, let's just start with a post that smells like trouble. How about this one? I can smell the trouble brewing already. Oh, interesting. Then let's filter our results around that specific term. And there you have it. See, there's a concentration of suspicious keyword usage on it's this like spider man. here. As to what man. sort of trouble is brewing, you'll have to rely on your good old-fashioned eyeballs. Shady activity isn't always the Rackin easiest man. to spot. Arachnid so man. Think of it as a sort of Does whatever hunt. arachnid treasure can. Hunt for trouble, huh? That sounds right up my alley. <laughs> Doesn't it? I can already picture you out there, helping people in need until it all pays off. What could await you at the end of the trail? My heart rate is already spiking. I'm just glad to have a helpful app for once. Hey, you know what? That reminds me. I also have a gadget here you may find useful. Can't always be glued to your phone, right? What is this? It's a high-end sound collector. It boosts the volume of mid-distance sounds, making them easier to hear from farther away. A sound collector, huh? Looks like a pistol. You use this to pick up cries for help, or even eavesdrop all over town. That's the idea. With enhanced hearing and geolocation capabilities, you'll be a trouble terminator. <laughs> Just like I've always wanted. Now, I do have some other gadgets in the works, but I'm still fine-tuning their UI. I'll show you soon enough. Looking forward to that. Rackton man, a Rackton man. Does whatever a Rackton man can. How's the lady, uh, Vile? I hope the lady's doing well. Dude, the last time I was looking in Zeke's stream, he still wasn't running the game. I mean, you've done more working than talking for most of the time you worked there, so they can eat your ass. all the problems while even getting women to talk to me on any of those dating apps because they're all such nightmares but that's okay i'm in no real hurry how many points do i have eight thousand 
Oh, man, she is a ways away, huh? Uh, what is a lucky menu? I don't want to put any points in these shits that aren't like. You know, I'm ready to do that. Uh, the joys of living in Chicago. The joys of living in Chicago. We haven't had like we got some snow on. Uh, uh, on like. Saturday or Friday night? I think it was like Friday night. Maybe it was Thursday night. I don't know. Oh, God. I just hang in there. How do I... Ah, fall. What the? That came from nowhere above me. Ha! Ah, what's that? Lake effect snow is the worst. Is is that a a person? Yeah, I'm about to fall. I can't. Hold on. Not good. I need help him now. Uh -huh. I can't make it. Hey, you okay? Huh? Who are you? Why are you here? I saw you from below. I came to help you. I, I'm saved. How did I ever let my hand slip? Wow, thank you so much. Come on, what's all the commotion? Why don't you help this guy instead of like, eek, what's going Please. on? Oh, are you a resident here? Listen, could you call for help? Don't tell me. Are you the Arachnid man? Wait, but there are two of you? Oh, God. Today I learned that even though the earliest version of Mickey Mouse has entered public domain, looking up how to draw Steamboat Willie is a bad idea without safe search of. Excuse me. <laughs> What's up, Leaf? Uh, it's a bit dangerous out here, so would you mind if we come inside? Uh, sure. Phew, that was close. Thanks for letting us in, ma'am. What the hell? Why were you two out there so high up? Jogging. I'm Takayuki Yagami, a detective. Yep. Detective, yes. Yes, you see, as I was walking along, I saw this person was about to fall in. <laughs> okay. Ha ha ha. My apologies for causing the scene. My name is Shinta Taro Tam Tamari. I'm Yuri Okichimachi. By the way. Well, Tamari, Tame son, what in the world are you doing out there? Mm -hmm. Uh, uh, well. That, that would be, actually, I was bird watching on the roof and I just took a wrong step. Mm -hmm. You were bird watching. Aww. Yeah, cause the thing is, 
I heard there was a rare bird living around here. A rare bird, huh? Which one would that be? Um, well, uh, a swallow? A swallow. Uh, 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 so you think swallows are common? Well, I'll let you know it's a white one that spawned from a spontaneous mutation. I found someone talking about it on the social media site, so I came here right away. The Rackton man does bird watching. Something's off about this. Hmm. Well, that's weird. Swallows are migratory birds. Shouldn't they be overseas right now to pass the winter? <laughs> huh? How you doing, Lee? Granted, this is from the internet, but the swallows who pass the winter in Japan are usually in the western regions. Seem like they'd be pretty rare here in the Can Kanto region. Yeah, yes, that's right. They're very rare, which is exactly why I want to see one. Uh. Okay, I see. Are you a resident of this apartment building? You're not, are you? Just a minute you ago, you said someone was talking about the bird on social media, so you ran over here. Oh, uh, very impressive, Mr. Detective. You're a sharp one. This apartment has an auto lock, so how did you get in? Er, well, that's... And the door to the roof is locked most of the time. And yet you managed to get up there? Uh... Well, well, that's because I did the same as you, Mr. Detective. I climbed up the wall of the apartment. <laughs> you climbed up just to do some bird watching? Y yeah, I love birds so much. I shall smash your skull like a clam on my tummy. MR Dong 101 is now following. Mr. Dong 101, thank you for that follow. Welcome to the Bird Ride. All hit Gizmo. I love that name. So the Arachnid Man's uh, everyone's talking about? Is that you? Yes, it does seem there are lots of rumors about me. I just want to bird watch from high places, but none of the buildings in the city allow non-residents inside. That's why I've been climbing the walls recently. So the so-called arachnid man was just a nerdy bird lover. This still doesn't make any sense. Pretty suspicious. You didn't think to yell and get help from the residents inside? <laughs> what? Yeah, I guess I could have done that. I didn't think of that. <laughs> Pretty suspicious. Even though this is fishy as hell, it's not like I have any evidence. I figured that it was you, Dong. What's up, buddy? What happened to your old name? I like your, uh, I like Mr. Dong 101. If I don't have evidence, I should back down, but at times like these, it sometimes helps to just observe. No. Huh? What's this? Based on the shape, that's women's underwear? That means God, he's a panty raider. Could I ask you something? Mm -hmm. Huh? Was there something else, Mr. Detective? What's it, that in your back pocket there? <laughs> Fuck him, Mr. Wrong. Oh, well, that's... This is... Uh... I know what they are. Those are panties. Ah! Ew! But those... Uh, could could these be yours, Oki Chi Machi San? I knew some of my best panties had gone missing. I see. So it appears you fell when you were stealing panties. <sighs> Anyways, I'm calling the police. You, you asshole! Not so fast. I'm gonna be the next Professor Panty, and I won't be caught here by the likes of you. No way. Fine, no choice but to use force then. <laughs> Professor Panty. Let's go. Oh, I'm near the face. They're just hating on a good Australian, Mr. Dong. They're just hating on you. <laughs> Damn it. But I was going to be the next Professor Panny. I know all of uh, Professor Panny. I caught him myself. What? What? You took him down? 
Even when I had him cornered, that pervert didn't even try to hide his creepiness. In fact, he was proud. He was brainwashed. Uh, he'd even brandished the damn panties at me, asking if I wanted to partake of the banquet with him. He, he was brave to the end. Honestly, you pale in comparison to Professor Panty. You'll never measure up to him. Vile, that's, uh, I mean, you're joking around with him, but you, I know how supportive of you are. You would never actually do anything, you know. Oh, yeah. Come on, let's go. Professor Panny. Excuse me, thank you for getting that panty thief. No. Oh, I'm just happy to help. You said you were a detective, yep. right? Yes. I, I typically do work uh, around Kamarucho, but I, lately I've been taking work on around... E e Jincho, uh, too. I'm currently working out of a detective agency called Yokohama 99. Feel free to contact me if you're ever in trouble, okay? Hee <laughs> hee. So you're going around helping people while also promoting your business. Smart. I get it. Well, next time there's someone I know in trouble, I'll make sure they find that their way to you. Please. Great. Thanks. I am the Patty Rat! God damn it, Marty! Few. Another case closer now. Another panty thief case, no less. You motherfucker. You motherfucker, Marty. Such a pain in my dick. Yeah, she she's a Frenchy poodle. It's a rare rare breed of poodle. Smile. A Frenchy doodle. A Frenchy poodle oodle. A Frenchy doodle poodle. Uh Zelda's finally getting her hair cut on Wednesday or Thursday. God damn it! Why do you motherfuckers keep doing this when, like, you let me get back at my computer? What's up, Arcane? <laughs> I'm I literally just got back from doing setups, Arcane. Also, I'm allowed to bust your balls a little bit. No, they're every 30 minutes. Mati. It's a six time per stream. Have fun, Vile. How you doing today, Arcane, you beautiful boy? Ugh.
Defeat the enemies. I just got hit by a boss. What a waste. What a waste. You guys remember the real bad skateboard in Deadly Premonition 2? Yagamishi, how was your first outing? Not bad. I handled the problem and name dropped you guys, so all in a day's work. <laughs> awesome! Sounds like the system's working gangbusters. By the way, if you'd like a little pro tip, you can enter keywords on your own, independent of any post. Why would I do that? Say you pick up a rumor in town, or hear someone drop a dubious phrase. Putting that into our keyword database will help refine the results algorithm. And thus, the program becomes more effective. In layman's terms, the more you enter new data, the more my program can learn. Gotcha. So this thing can hone its street smarts along with me. Correct. Do make use of the system often, if you could. I know this is a lot, but one last thing. We've also got a bulletin board for case requests. A good number of them are somewhat beyond our current capacity. So if you ever feel like it, Maybe you can pick them up. Hey, never hurts to have more income. I'll take a look sometime. Body model in the science room has been moving. I admit it makes me decent. Uh, it makes her a decent scare for high schoolers. So I wonder how long till the. Uh the drone racing shit comes back. Yeah, 
Dude, I haven't eaten at a restaurant the whole time I've been playing this. Let's see. Let's go get food real quick. Because they have a little mystery item bullshit. Oh, this is... Starving. Pretty tasty. Thanks. I like. I beat up everyone so fast. I don't usually need a lot of health. God damn it. God damn it. I keep running into everything. I've been looking, really looking nice. at all my divorce paperwork, and it's such a pain in the ass, man. It's not that big of a deal, but like, ugh, I don't know. Still trying to figure out how to fucking completely separate the fucking resources. Do you think they implant devices in the people who take? I don't know, but I saw it with my own eyes. A real UFO right here in Ichin Cho. You know, I remember hearing about an alien abduction here in town a couple years back. Some third year that goes here has dead up and disappeared. Jeez, talk about spooky. UFOs and all uh, over chatter now. Two, people are saying someone might get abducted again. Abduction by a UFO? <laughs> Let's get out of here before they take us too. I have to admit, I'm pretty curious about this. One of them mentioned chatter. I should see what that the fuss is. All right, people might have been talking about a human body model that moves in, even walks around at night.